Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna to show you how to make paleo pumpkin muffins with cinnamon streusel. For the muffins, you're going to need three large eggs, one cup of pumpkin puree, a third cup of coconut milk full fat, one third cup of coconut sugar, two tablespoons of pure maple syrup, one teaspoon of pure vanilla extract, one three-fourths cup of blanched almond flour, a fourth a cup of arrowroot starch, one tablespoon of coconut flour, one teaspoon of baking soda, one tablespoon of pumpkin pie spice, half a teaspoon of cinnamon, and a pinch of fine grain sea salt. For the streusel topping, you will need 3 fourths cup of blanched almond flour, 1 third cup of coconut sugar, 1 teaspoon of pumpkin pie spice, an eighth a teaspoon of sea salt, and 1 fourths cup of coconut oil. First thing you will need to do is preheat your oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. And then you will need to line your muffin pan with some liners, and I got these from Target. So first I'm going to take the pumpkin puree and put it in my mixing bowl. Then I'm gonna crack three eggs. Then I'm going to add in my maple syrup, then the vanilla extract, then the coconut milk. Pretty much just your wet ingredients first. And then I'm gonna mix that all together. I just use this like spatula thing from Williams Sonoma. You can use um, a KitchenAid, you can use a whisk, whatever you like. I don't always use my KitchenAid just because I feel like it's just a lot to clean up and I bake so often that doing this um, just works for me. So mix it up until it's smooth. This is my first time cooking with pumpkin this season and I'm really excited about it because who doesn't like pumpkin? Next, I'm gonna add in my dry ingredients. I'm going to first put in my almond flour, then the coconut sugar. You can also use maple sugar if you don't have coconut. Then the pumpkin spice and the cinnamon, a little pinch of salt, coconut flour, arrowroot starch, and you can also use tapioca if you don't have arrowroot. And then lastly, the baking soda. So I'm going to mix that all together. So I'm gonna put this to the side and clean off my spatula and then mix up the streusel topping. So pretty much for the streusel topping, I'm just gonna combine all of the ingredients and you want your coconut oil to not be melted and to still be solid because that's what helps makes it all crumbly. So I'm gonna add in the almond flour, then the coconut sugar. Again, you can use maple sugar if you prefer that. Then the salt, pumpkin spice, and then the coconut oil. Now I'm pretty much just gonna smush it with my spatula Actually, I think I'm going to use my hands because I think that's going to help make it a little bit more of a crumble. My hands are clean, I promise. While I fill the muffin tins with the pumpkin mixture, I'm just going to pop this in the fridge just for a little bit to try to cool it down as much as possible. So now I'm going to evenly disperse the muffin mixture into the muffin tins. Now I'm going to sprinkle some of the streusel topping over every muffin. I'm just gonna pop that in the oven for about 22 minutes. I've taken my muffins out of the oven. They smell amazing. I can't wait to try them. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please let me know if you did, and I will see you all in my next one. Bye.